today i'm going to be playing wwe 2k20 but i'm only going to have one minute to draft the best roster possible now there's really no rules to this i can draft anybody i want i can draft celebrities wrestlers it doesn't matter as long as i draft them in one minute if you guys do go on to enjoy this video remember to subscribe to the channel it's absolutely free and you could always change your mind later we're on the road to 350 000 subscribers now let's get into the video and we're just gonna jump right into it timer starts now here we go so i want adam cole i want aj styles i gotta i gotta make this quick i i gotta get people that i actually want and then i also kind of want to get some goofy people in here as well uh where is you know what we'll get shinsuke where is seth rollins bro I, okay there we go there we go um i don't know who else i want uh give me you know give me brock give me buddy murphy um oh you know what give me the baby you know what why not uh give me daniel dolph i don't know how many people i'm gonna be able to draft in the next 30 seconds uh we got drew mcintyre give me the fiend uh give me finn balor uh let's get some diversity in here let's get kermit the frog um we get we get a little pump uh you know what i love mark henry let's get mark henry um i got 17 seconds hold on hold on i'll get kevin owens uh keith lee where's john cena bro there we go we got john cena give me jay uso not okay i got jake the snake roberts too um i got four seconds um um one final pig uh no i didn't mean to take him off okay we got brutus beefcake and that's one minute <laughs> so in that one minute i was able to draft 23 people i did so great and since I only have 23 people, I don't think I grabbed any women. So we're going to get rid of the women's championship. We're also going to get rid of the women's tag team championships. And I don't have any tag teams. So we're going to get rid of these two. Um, so I guess we'll just be stuck with the world title and the mid card title plus the money in the bank briefcase. Now I want to choose my champions. I did this last time with the number generator video. Um, so out of all these people, who do I want to make the world heavyweight champion oh actually you know what before we do that i kind of want to change the championships i'm gonna make the world championship the winged eagle championship um and who do i want to make the world champion you know what just because i miss my boy we're gonna make john cena the world heavyweight champion or the wwe champion i should say and we're gonna change the mid card title to you know what let's just do current day intercontinental championship i kind of like the way that one looks and we're gonna make we're gonna make dominic mysterio the intercontinental champion okay so now i'm gonna draft the divisions and i'll show you guys what we got going on once it's all put together all right so for the intercontinental championship we got shinsuke nakamura finn balor dolph ziggler seth rollins buddy murphy adam cole jay uso lil pump the baby mark henry and brutus beefcake and for the wwe championship we got brock roman aj kevin daniel bryan drew mcintyre keith lee kermit the frog <laughs> jake roberts and the fiend bray wyatt for this video we're only going to be simming the pay-per-views and whatever the wwe championship match at wrestlemania is that's the one we're going to watch so let's go ahead and simulate some money in the bank and let's see what's going down oh my god in an eight-man ladder match we got roman reigns keith lee the fiend bray wyatt aj styles brock daniel kermit the frog and dominic mysterio for the money in the bank briefcase and we got buddy versus brutus adam versus jay seth and lil pump kevin owens versus john cena for the wwe championship and then another eight man ladder match i don't think this one's actually gonna count uh cedric alexander wasn't even drafted <laughs> who's gonna win the money in the bank briefcase and aj styles won the briefcase that's interesting and then brutus beefcake beat buddy murphy adam beat jay uh seth rollins beat lil pump uh kevin owens did not get the wwe championship r.i.p and then mark henry won this other eight man ladder match that meant nothing <laughs> all right so now let's go ahead and go on to the extreme rules pay-per-view i'm just gonna simulate off the bat daniel bryan beats jake roberts brutus beats lil pump brutus beefcake is going on a roll here drew mcintyre beat keith lee finn balor defeated adam cole shinsuke nakamura is the new intercontinental champion uh seth rollins defeated dolph ziggler uh kevin owens defeated aj styles brock beat kermit the frog okay <laughs> and then in a non-title match roman defeats the wwe champion john cena so only the intercontinental championship was on the line that's pretty interesting okay next up is SummerSlam. let's see what's going down on the card the baby gets a win over jay uso then adam cole loses to brutus beefcake brutus is going on a roll he okay the way this is shaping up he could win the royal rumble <laughs> buddy murphy defeats mark henry the fiend defeats keith lee 
uh seth rollins beats dolph ziggler jake the snake roberts takes an l to daniel bryan we have a new intercontinental champion aj defeats kevin owens kermit the frog beats brock lesnar okay <laughs> and then john cena retains the wwe championship in a triple threat match against roman reigns and drew mcintyre that is a current day dream match honestly i would love to see that to open the show it's kevin owens versus john cena for the wwe title can kevin owens take home the championship john cena retains he's gonna be holding this thing for a minute brutus beefcake is on a roll right now he defeats adam cole uh jake defeats keith lee then shinsuke nakamura gets the intercontinental championship back this title is doing a whole bunch of hot potato right now seth rollins defeats dolph ziggler again the baby beats buddy murphy i think again aj styles defeats drew mcintyre kermit the frog is going against brock lesnar and he keeps winning and then daniel bryan beats roman reigns in a hell in a cell match now we're at super showdown and i don't know if anything interesting is going to be going down on this pay-per-view so brock lesnar defeats drew mcintyre brutus beefcake is he undefeated right now For, from what i know this man is undefeated he beat low pump dolph ziggler takes an l against jay uso roman reigns takes an l against keith lee okay keith then buddy murphy beats seth rollins finn balor retains the intercontinental championship this time uh, or did he win it i don't know usually the person on the right is the one with the championship so maybe shinsuke won it back after we simulated either way finn balor wins the intercontinental championship john cena retains the title again he may hold it all the way the baby uh beats adam cole and then kevin owens defeats aj styles at super showdown now we're at survivor series and i want to see the team for this pay-per-view drew defeats kevin owens adam cole defeats mark henry then team buddy murphy defeats team brock lesnar that is a very interesting team on the left here <laughs> then kermit the frog defeats keith lee kermit is starting to go on a roll like brutus beefcake is shinsuke nakamura defeats jay uso seth rollins is the new intercontinental champion john cena retains the wwe championship again this man is not gonna drop this title is he and then aj styles defeats roman reigns the last pay-per-view of the year it is time for tlc See what is going down. Shinsuke Nakamura loses to the baby. The baby, Kermit the Frog, and Brutus Beefcake are all top contenders for the Royal Rumble. That's all I'm saying right now. Jay Uso defeats Buddy Murphy. Keith Lee defeats the Fiend, which is very interesting. Dolph Ziggler beats Brutus. Never mind, Brutus. You may not be a top contender for the Royal Rumble anymore. Seth Rollins retains the Intercontinental Championship. Low Pump defeats Adam Cole. Kermit the Frog is on a roll still. He beats Kevin Owens. AJ Styles defeats Roman Reigns. John Cena retains against Brock Lesnar. John is not dropping this title, is he? And then Daniel Bryan defeats Drew McIntyre in a TLC match, I guess for a briefcase of some sort. <laughs> and now it is time for the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Let's take a look at the card. Kevin Owens defeats Kermit the Frog. Dolph Ziggler defeats Brutus Beefcake. The Fiend defeats Keith Lee. Then Seth Rollins retains the Intercontinental Championship. Okay, Seth is starting to retain the title. No more hot potato. Now we're starting to get some set champions. Jey Uso loses to Finn Balor. Um, Drew McIntyre loses to Brock Lesnar. John Cena wins against Daniel Bryan, but not for the title though. Roman Reigns defeats AJ Styles. And who won this 10-man Royal Rumble match? Let's go ahead and check the news. Daniel Bryan has won the Royal Rumble. So right now it's looking like Daniel Bryan versus John Cena for the WWE title. Okay, so we have this six-man elimination chamber match. Again, Cedric Alexander did not get drafted. Uh, Daniel Bryan won the elimination chamber, but this one's not for the championship. So we gotta, I'm very curious about that. Dolph defeats Brutus Beefcake again. Lil Pump beats Buddy Murphy. Jey Uso defeats Finn Balor. Adam Cole loses to the baby. Uh, Seth Rollins retains the Intercontinental Championship yet again. Will John Cena retain the WWE Championship? And he does. This man is not dropping the title. John Cena has held this championship for 293 days that is insane now seth rollins has held the intercontinental championship for 105 days will he be able to retain the championship throughout the rest of this video but regardless we're at fast lane this is the last pay-per-view before wrestlemania brock lesnar defeats drew mcintyre buddy murphy defeats low pump 
Jay Uso is the new Intercontinental Champion. That's that's pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's pretty cool. Uh, Finn Balor defeats Shinsuke Nakamura in a fatal four way between Kevin, AJ, Roman, and Keith Lee. Keith Lee defeats everybody, which is a huge win for him. Um, Adam Cole loses against the baby again. The Fiend unfortunately could not win the WWE Championship, so John Cena's reign is still going. And then Dolph Ziggler defeats Brutus Beefcake in the main event of Fastlane. I feel like that should have made it too. <laughs> okay, so let's take a look at the match card for WrestleMania. We got Brock Lesnar versus Drew McIntyre, Shinsuke Nakamura versus Adam Cole, Lil Pump versus Brutus Beefcake, Keith Lee versus Roman Reigns, and a no holds barred match. That is a dream match. That would be fire. The baby versus uh Buddy Murphy, then Seth Rollins versus Mark Henry, Kermit the Frog versus Jake Roberts. Kevin Owens versus AJ Styles. Then we got the WWE Championship match that we will be watching between Daniel Bryan and John Cena. And in the main event is Finn Balor, Dolph Ziggler, and Jey Uso for the Intercontinental Championship? That, that would be a banger. But anyways, let's go ahead and simulate Brock. Oh, takes an L to Drew McIntyre. I was, I was getting ready to say Brock wins. <laughs> Shinsuke versus Adam Cole and Shinsuke Nakamura gets the win. Low Pump versus Brutus Beefcake. And Low Pump takes the W. Keith Lee versus Roman in their no holds barred match. And Keith Lee defeats Roman Reigns. The baby versus Buddy Murphy. And Buddy actually beat the baby. I was expecting the baby to win. He was getting a lot of wins throughout this episode. Seth Rollins defeats Mark Henry. Maybe? Yes, he does. Okay, that's what I was expecting. <laughs> Kermit the Frog versus Jake Roberts. Who's winning this one? Kermit defeats Jake Roberts. Wow. <laughs> uh, Kevin Owens versus AJ Styles. And AJ Styles gets the win over Kevin Owens. And now it is time for the WWE Championship match between Daniel Bryan and John Cena. Let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, it's about to go down. It's John Cena versus Daniel Bryan. Hey, give me this SummerSlam match again, boy. They, they had a banger at SummerSlam. Is this a squash? Is this? John Cena has 95%. Is this a squash match? Is this Brandon Collins versus Drew McIntyre all over again? This better not be a squash match. Bro, are you kidding me? Is this a glitch? Do the Royal Rumble winners just get screwed over? Oh my God, not like this. Daniel, you better not tap. You better not tap out right now. This is not, this is not how it's supposed to go. John Cena literally gave up on him. Oh, oh, Daniel, he reversed it. He reversed the AA, hold up now. Okay, I got swerved, I got swerved. The crowd is behind Daniel Bryan right now. This is what you love to see. John Cena rolls out of harm's way. John has held the WWE Championship for 321 days. Will his reign continue or will it end here at WrestleMania? Oh, Daniel missed, he missed. Okay, yeah, that's gonna be his downfall. He just needs to hit his signature. If he pins him off of this, John, don't be like this. One, two. Oh, Daniel Bryan kicks out. Okay, this is an interesting matchup now. <laughs> For a minute, I thought he was gonna give him the super attitude adjustment or whatever, but I forgot he doesn't even have his finisher or now he has his finisher, but this match is over. Daniel, please reverse it. Please, please do it. Do it for me. Do it for me. Come on, Daniel. Oh, yep, it's over. Hey, hey, the, the WWE Championship reign continues and that's a wrap. What is up with the Royal Rumble winners? going to wrestlemania and getting squashed what is this is this a glitch congratulations you definitely deserve to be the wwe champion all right so now it is time for the main event of wrestlemania in a triple threat match is finn dolphin jay for the intercontinental championship and i forgot who the champion was but finn balor walks out of wrestlemania with the intercontinental championship before we go i just want to see if john can hold this championship for a full year he's held it for 336 days so I'm gonna simulate to Money in the Bank and let's see if he'll be able to retain. In the opening match for Money in the Bank, it's John Cena versus Jake Roberts. 
will john cena retain and he does he is definitely gonna hold it for a year what else is on the card i'm just curious jay versus brutus dolph versus finn Balor, and finn Balor retains the title then uh kevin owens is the new money in the bank briefcase holder uh seth rollins defeats mark henry and then cedric alexander who wasn't even drafted won the eight-man ladder match <laughs> well john cena has held the title for 364 days and he's not even on this card from monday night raw so that definitely means he has held it for a year what a guy you get you clap it up for john cena he held it all the way through this video what a guy and shout out to finn balor he held the intercontinental championship three times in this one year that's pretty crazy guys if you did enjoy this video remember to drop a like let's see if we can go for 4,000 likes click one of these two videos on screen if you want to keep watching the videos i used a number generator to draft my roster and that one was pretty cool you should watch that one and then you can watch something completely different right here deuces